Have you ever thought to yourself that you're not beautiful or that other people don't think you're beautiful? I know everyone had that thought at least once in their life, but I also know that there are people out there who struggle with those thoughts every single day. But in order to answer that question, you have to know what true beauty actually is. And when I started thinking, what is true beauty actually? I realized that I didn't know. So instead of thinking about it for forever, I decided to ask a few people to help me out and tell me their opinion on what true beauty is. And this is what they said. True beauty does not care what lip gloss you wear. True beauty does not lie in your hair. True beauty goes beyond skin, flesh and bone. True beauty is what you're like on your own. True beauty isn't some fairy tale. True beauty is what you decide to do in your own tale. Beauty. Um, I think beauty is a very, very big word and a lot of people have different opinions about it. For me personally, I think beauty means being confident and just loving yourself no matter what other people think or say. And um, I mean, you are you at the end of the day and there's no one else who is you. So just do what you love to do, be passionate about it and be nice and you will be the most beautiful person you could ever be. Um, what do I think true beauty is? Well, for me, it's all about how we act, our behavior. Um, for example, it's not only about staying true to yourself, but also realizing that there's always room for improvement and that you're not perfect. Um, and just striving to be the best that you can possibly be in a positive manner. Um, but at the same time, also encouraging other people and saying that, allowing them to know that it's okay for them to be themselves and also allowing them to strive to be the best that they can possibly be. We often talk about how true beauty is inner beauty, not outer beauty, but what really is inner beauty? To me, a person is beautiful on the inside when they're loving. When we put too much emphasis on outer beauty, sometimes we can become just a little self-absorbed, always thinking about ourselves, thinking, how do I look? But true beauty is being selfless and thinking about others. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what other people say to you or about you. The only thing that is really important is how you see and feel about yourself. I'm pretty sure that if you go in front of the mirror right now and try to find two qualities, you will find at least five things that you really like about yourself. So I would really like you to do that because it's a good exercise and if you do it more often, you will realize that you're not as bad as other people say and in fact you're a really beautiful person on the outside and on the inside. For me, true beauty means being confident in your own skin. It's about embracing your flaws and realizing that what you think may be imperfect is actually viewed as beautiful by others. I don't think that true beauty can actually be defined but I do believe that it's a quality everyone already embodies. Real beauty for me is having a bursting personality. It's all about confidence. It's all about being brave enough to do whatever you want to do without feeling judged and without hurting anybody. You want to wear a sparky cowboy hat on the street? Just go ahead and do it! Will they call you a freak? They don't know how much fun you're having. They don't know what they're missing. I think that beautiful people are those who are not ashamed to show the others how much beautiful they are. Beauty, real, powerful and true beauty, comes from within here. We should know that deep down, beauty is really about believing that the whole is better than the sum. That means you, yes all of you, is much more beautiful in relation to any imperfection that you may believe you have. Imperfections are natural and natural is beautiful. So whatever imperfections you think you may have, they are not ugly, they are not wrong. They are beautiful because they make you, you. So what's my take on beauty? Well, to me, it's like comparing fast food with healthy foods, you know, like vegetables. Outer beauty and inner beauty. I think it's better for you to be beautiful on the inside and a little bit on the outside. Because you know what? If you're beautiful on the outside, people will only judge you from the outside. And when they know that you are ugly from the inside, they will leave you anyway. But if you're beautiful on the inside, people will stay with you. And you know what? If you become old and you were beautiful, 
then you will lose that beauty. You know, your boobs are going to hang, you are going to get wrinkles and everything. You will lose all your beauty. But if you're beautiful on the inside, you will stay like that even when you're old. And people will appreciate that. So just be beautiful here. And maybe a little bit here. And here. But that's my take on beauty. What do you think true beauty is? I think true beauty is much bigger than one word. True beauty is confidence, this breathtaking feeling in your stomach when you see a person and there is something about them that you can really describe no matter how they look. It's all of the little things about this person. It's the way he smiles, the way he touches his hair, his own universe inside of his head and his heart and the whole world that you're keeping inside of you is truly beautiful. It is something that only you can have. This uniqueness is truly beautiful. Because it's not about the perfect features of your face and a perfect body, it's about a personality. A personality which is beautiful already. I think the true beauty is you. True beauty isn't about having perfect hair or having flawless skin. It's more about being comfortable in your own skin and accepting yourself for who you are. And also being able to accept others for who they are no matter where they come from or what they look like. I guess true beauty can be a lot of different things. But yeah, this is what I think. And you will probably get another answer if you ask somebody else. So after hearing this, I started to realize something. True beauty? It doesn't exist. Everyone thinks of something different when they think about beauty. But the thing they don't think about is about the imperfections. Everyone has something they dislike about themselves. Maybe it's your blonde hair, maybe it's your red hair, maybe it's your freckles, maybe it's your weight, maybe you wish you were smarter or more social. But that doesn't matter because that's not what defines beauty. I don't think true beauty can be defined because everyone thinks differently when they think about beauty. And true beauty? That's what you make of it. You are beautiful, and even if it's not according to your own standards, it will be to someone else's. Because there's always going to be someone out there who loves you for who you are. There's always going to be someone out there who thinks you truly are beautiful. Thank you so much for watching, and I really hope this helped you out. I also want to thank all the YouTubers that helped me out with making this video. I will have their faces on the screen right now, so if you want to check out their channels, definitely go ahead and do that, because they all have positive messages to give, and they're all amazing people. Also, if you want to be part of letting people know what true beauty actually is, go to the comments down below and write down what you think true beauty actually is. Also, if you have a friend or just someone you know that you think might need this video, please send this to them because you have no clue how much a simple word or a simple video can help someone out. And if this is the thing that will make them realize how beautiful they are, then I'm happy that we made this. Even if just one person will be helped with this, then I will be happy. So this leaves me with only one thing left to say. Stay beautiful.